Welcome aboard the beautiful Azamara journey. We would like to invite you for a once in a lifetime experience. How about Carnival in Rio de Janeiro? I'm certain you've heard about it. So why not join us on a 10 night voyage from beautiful Buenos Aires to exciting Rio de Janeiro. On your first port of call, you will find yourself in the chic Uruguayan resort town of Punta del Este, where we will arrive at eight o'clock in the morning. And because there are so many activities for you to enjoy, remain at anchor until 11 o'clock in the evening. What is there to do, you ask? How about a boat trip to Sea Lion Island? You can play casino, visit the beaches, or my favorite, lunch in the chic resort of San Ignacio. Following two days at sea, we arrive in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil at 12 noon. We will spend the next two and a half days docked in Rio for you to enjoy the carnival parades. What is it like, you ask? Well, think about it like going to a baseball game. It is all very organized and because we spent both days in Rio de Janeiro, you have the opportunity to see both the parade on Sunday night as well as the parade on Monday night. We will be also offering you two types of tickets so you can choose the seat of your choice. For those of you having purchased tickets, we will depart the ship at approximately seven o'clock in the evening and make our way to the Sambotrom Stadium. We will arrive at approximately 7.45 in the evening and just like at a baseball game, you will find concession stands, souvenir stands, all very organized. The parade commences at nine o'clock in the evening and each of the six Samba schools parading on each night will take approximately 90 minutes to parade through the stadium. This event goes on until six o'clock in the morning. However, starting at midnight, we will offer you a shuttle bus back to the ship every hour on the hour. My recommendation, six o'clock in the morning is the time to leave because you get to sleep in the next day and do it all over again on Monday night. It is a different parade with different dances each of the two nights and we suggest that you see at least one of the two parades on Sunday or Monday evening. You still have the next day in Rio de Janeiro to enjoy some of the many exciting activities such as a visit to the Christ statue on Corcovado, take the cable car to the Sugarloaf, or how about hang gliding, my favorite activity in Rio. Following your stay in Rio de Janeiro, we head to the chic resort town of Buzios, Brazil, where we will remain at anchor until 11 o'clock in the evening for you to take in the exciting nightlife. Many boutiques and beaches await you at Buzios, and it is also one of our guests' favorite ports along the Brazilian coast. Next, we stop at my favorite port, Parachi, the colonial town with its whitewashed building set dramatically against the high mountains and the rainforest in the back. We highly recommend that you also spend some time ashore in Parachi in the evening when the street lights come on and a special atmosphere greets its visitors as you walk along the shops, boutiques and coffee shops. Last but not least, our final port of call is the Brazilian resort of Ilabella. Many beaches await, as do shops, and one of my favorites, zipping through the tropical rainforest. From Ilabella, we sail on back to Rio de Janeiro, where we bid farewell and thank you for traveling on board the Azamara journey.